The name clownfish refers to the 28 different species of fish that reside within sea anemones. Sea anemones are predators that attach themselves to rocks or coral. When prey comes by, they shoot out a long, poisonous thread with toxins that will paralyze prey. Clownfish typically live in small groups that inhabit a single anemone. The group will consist of a breeding pair and a few younger fish. The younger fish are always male. Clownfish are hermaphrodites, meaning they possess the ability to change sex. All clownfish are born as males. Only the largest male of a group will change into a female. If the female dies, the breeding male will change into a female. This is called sequential hermaphroditism. A female clownfish will lay her eggs at the base of the anemone. The male will guard the eggs and chase off any fish that come too close. After hatching, the baby fish will spend around 10 days drifting with the current. Then, they settle at the bottom and start looking for anemones to live in. Once they find a suitable anemone, clownfish will gently touch their body against the tentacles of the anemones to gain immunity against their sting. A layer of mucus will form on the clownfish's skin for protection, and it will be free to reside inside its new anemone home. Clownfish are omnivores that mainly feed on remnants of the anemone's prey and any parasites on the anemone. A clownfish may even help an anemone catch its prey by luring other fish in. Clownfish will live 6 to 10 years and only grow to around 5 inches in length. All species reside in the Indo-Pacific and Red Sea. Their colors can range from orange to red, yellow, and maroon. The clownfish in Finding Nemo is called a false clown anemone fish. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.